All right, welcome to Beijing, guys. My name's George, this is Imperial Chow. You're just trying to mess up my hair, aren't you? <laughs> All right, let's try it. <laughs> okay, so what was it? Okay, so back to basics. Dumplings, Mr. Schur's, sweet and savory, taste test, cuddly toys. Okay, cool. Welcome back to Beijing and this week's episode of Imperial Chow. Oh, dumplings. <laughs> Mr. Schur's dumpling restaurant to try a whole variety of pump Dumpling, pumpling. Oh, it's a pump, pumpling. <laughs> Is it Mr. Shu or Mr. Shi? Hi guys, and welcome back to Beijing and this week's episode of Imperial Chow. My name's George, and today I'm at Bao Chow Hutong to check out Mr. Shu's dumpling restaurant. Welcome to the world famous Bao Chao Hutong, one of the most well known and better kept hutongs in Beijing. Every day, lots of tourists and locals alike walk up and down and all around these alleyways, and with good reason. This is a great location to find the latest and most Instagrammy food in all of Beijing. Right as you come in, you can see a typical Chinese hutong courtyard. This is the way Chinese houses used to look back in the day, and although some people still live here, most of the hutongs have become bars, eateries, clubs, and pubs. While today is no exception, we're at Lao Shi Jiaozi Jia Chang Tai, one of the most beloved dumpling spots in town. Not only do you get to try traditional Beijing flavors, but Mr. Shu is also willing to try new things and recipes to impress his customers. We're gonna try a whole variety of dumplings and then take some on the road for a taste test and hopefully give away some of these lovely fellas. Okay, so we're here with Mr. Sure himself. Mr. Sure, thank you for having me today. I love this place. I love your jiaozi. Can you tell me something a bit more about yourself? So Mr. Sure, can you tell me more about Mr. Sure's restaurant? Uh, when you started and why you started? 老师睡觉呢是二零零八年八月八号开业的和奥运会是同一年开业的到现在呢有十三年的历史呃期间呢我们呢除除了做这个传统的饺子以外我们还发明了一些这个西式的睡觉比如说直式睡觉啊还有那
。在这十三年当中呢，我们不断的开发新品，新品呢现在开发的有芝士馅的，还有咖喱馅的，还有巧克力香蕉馅的。这一部分那个产品呢，不但吸引了很多的那个外国朋友，而且也很吸引中国的一些年轻的男孩子、女孩子一起。啊，到这里来吃这个饺子。刚开始的外国人并不多，啊，不像现在这么多。呃，后来呢，我就在想一个办法，就是到这里来就餐的外国朋友呢，可以在我的墙壁上画一面檀木果林的国旗。那第二个人来的时候，他看到一定非常的开心。所以说呢，就像滚雪球一样，越来越人多，越来越人多。So, what would you say to anyone that hasn't been to Mr. Shur's restaurant? Why should they come, and what can they expect? Uh, we've been here for 13 years, and I also hope that more foreigners will come to enjoy Chinese food. And in this environment, you can try to eat yourself and eat yourself. The teacher is waiting for you for 13 years. We welcome you to come to the teacher. Hey guys, here we have it. When you talk about dumplings, this is probably the most common dish you're going to see all across China. It's the pork and cabbage jiaozi, minced pork, diced cabbage, steamed, absolutely delicious. You can have it just as it is, or you can mix it with vinegar, soy sauce, with a spicy oil. You can see this for breakfast, for lunch, even dinner. So here we have a seafood platter of dumplings, a lighter alternative to pork and beef. We have bass, mackerel, and clams. So not only are they all high in protein, but they're also rich in omega-3 fats. You can see that some of the skins have been dyed. The black ones have used octopus ink to dye the flour. The green ones have used a spinach sauce. Really fantastic, and you don't need to worry about bones. Although dumplings are the main attraction at Mr. Sure's dumpling restaurant, he also has a wide variety of hot and cold dishes to accompany your dumplings. Here we've got a Beijing-style salad: peppers, carrots, radishes, lettuce, strips of tofu, wood-eared fungus, and peanuts. Super refreshing, crunchy, and absolute banger for any dumpling meal. Now here is where things get interesting. You may think these are taquitos, but actually these are Guotia-style dumplings that are really famous in Henan Province. Mr. Sure deep fries them instead of boiling them for a crunchier texture. Here we've got chicken, corn, and cheese, which is quite an unusual ingredient in dumplings, but I love them. I'm going to add some vinegar and some spicy oil to dunk each. Guotia into. Mm. 
so good. Well, I'm convinced, I'm a believer. And I think it's good to spread the word, especially of good places to eat. So let's take these and go outside and see if we can't find some people to play a little game with.我刚刚在老师饺子夹香菜吃的特别好吃的饺子我想分享给大家所以我们看一下在大陆上有没有人愿意尝一尝所以我这有两个不同口味的饺子看一下谁能不能吃出来是什么馅儿而且猜对的话